Have you ever heard about the Angelus Prayer? It's a great prayer for young people, especially those wondering what to do with their life. The Angelus Prayer is a traditional Catholic devotion that used to be prayed at noon and at 6 p.m. each day. In fact, some towns, you might still hear the church bells ringing out at noon and at 6 o'clock. Well, why would the Angelus Prayer be a great prayer for young people trying to figure out their path, their vocation, their calling in life from God? The great thing about the Angelus Prayer, as pointed out by Pope Benedict in the 2008 World Youth Day in Sydney, Australia, is that the Angelus Prayer is a prayer for young people at the cusp of their beginning because this prayer has to do with the story of the Blessed Virgin Mary. The lines of this prayer come from the Gospel of Luke, chapter 1, when the angel Gabriel comes to Mary and proposes to her God's plan for salvation. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the Holy Spirit. As we pray that Angel's Prayer and say those lines, we call, a mind, we call to mind the fact that when God went about saving the human world and saving the human race, he invited us to partake in it from the very beginning, our humanity sharing with Mary's humanity. And so Mary, on our behalf, in that moment in the little town of Nazareth, oh, about 2,000 years ago, she said yes to God's plan. And so when you pray the Angelus Prayer, you have an opportunity to add your own yes to Mary's yes. Just as in other ways in your Christian life, you add your yes and make your yes to God's plan. But this one especially because it had to do with Mary's calling. What dreams did Mary have? What ideas, what thoughts about her own life did the Blessed Virgin Mary have? She certainly was a devout woman, a woman of great faith. As the angel Gabriel says to her, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. But whatever her plans were, they probably never would have imagined of, that she would become the mother of the Messiah, the mother of the one who all Israel, Mary included, was waiting for, the one who would come to redeem all mankind, the one who would come to fulfill the promise made to Abraham that all nations of the earth would be blessed through her. What is God asking you to do and what dreams do you have? Your dreams might be good dreams, helping people, blessing them, bringing goodness to their life as a teacher, as a doctor, as a farmer, or something else. But God might ask you to take part in a greater plan, something even better than you could have imagined. Just as Mary would have had no idea, even though she'd say, all generations will call me blessed, she didn't know how blessed she would be and how wonderful her name would become because of her yes to God. So I encourage you, check out the Angelus Prayer. Include it as part of your vocational discernment and ask for Mary to help you hear God's call in your life. Ask St. Gabriel the Archangel to help you hear God's call in your life and ask them to help you say yes. Yes to God, yes to his plan, yes to his dreams, which are more than we can ask or imagine. God bless you. I love you.